for the next hundred miles or so, we're gonna follow the Long Trail, um, which is a trail that goes all the way from the Vermont, Massachusetts border to the Canadian border um, with Quebec. We're gonna be on the Long Trail for about a hundred miles. The whole trail is 300 miles. We're only gonna be on it for a hundred miles, and then we're gonna turn and go um, into New Hampshire. But that's gonna be cool. Vermont! Woohoo! Woo I made this little spout and I'm just proud of it. A little, I'm just a little proud of it. I put this rock in and this leaf and those rocks and it made a spout that I could get water from. And let's look at it from far away because it, it stands out. It's very beautiful. So beautiful. It's nice to see those mountains and the breeze blowing the storm in for tonight. Woohoo! We're really hoping for shelter space. Yeah, we are. Really hoping for it. Okay. I'm feeling a low point. That's really a low point right now. It's supposed to rain tonight all night and we just got to our shelter and it was completely full. So we have to hike four more miles and it's like 7.30. 4.6 and it's 7.45. Not to, not to make it worse, but... And guess what else happened? What? Coyote tripped over a guy's tent. Don't even remind me. It's been so bad. And Coyote also tripped over her pole and smashed it to the ground while crying. <laughs> like, this is just like not a good moment. This is day two of the long trail, and it's raining. We made it to a shelter last night. I mean, it's only barely sprinkling right now, but the plants are all wet, which means my socks are wet. I look so tired. We are. Oh my gosh, yesterday was horrible. We just found some really good examples of camouflage. I think they might be eating the ferns too. So there's one hiding as a stem, and then we have Hiding is a stem too. Very cool. Hey, look at this little girl. <gasps> you should put her down. <laughs> okay, there's just these bubbles under the tree. It looks like bubble bath stuff. We're in the middle of the woods, literally. What is that? Kind of cool. Okay, so we had just made it to the top of this like 10 mile climb. And then when we got up there, um, I looked at my email. I had a job interview for a school in the fall. And they said, and they said, um, we'd love to interview you tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. We're 30 miles from a town in one direction, 10 miles from a town in the other direction. But down the hill that we had just climbed, there's no like side trails to get us anywhere. There's no small roads we're crossing. So Radio and I, are currently walking down the 10 mile mountain that we had just walked up earlier today and we're gonna go down and do my job interview and then tomorrow we're gonna walk right back up this whole mountain again look at this little thing I saw one of these the other day very cool <gasps> oh my gosh she wiggled away <gasps> Pine. Where? <gasps> Hi, girl! There it is. Cute. By the end of today, when we get back down to the road to go into Bennington, we will have hiked a total of 24.5 miles for the day, but we actually, in reality, will only have hiked 
4.3 miles forward on the AT. And we were only planning on hiking 18. We said, man, the last couple days have been really hard. We gotta take it easy on ourselves. We're only gonna hike 18.7. And then this happened. They say one of these is uh, not great luck. Yeah. Hey. Hey. So yeah, we've got black flies now. <laughs> We're pacing to keep them away. Yeah, I think you can see them all. <laughs> uh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you have a horde following you. Vermont, baby. Next section looks pretty rough. So let's see how it goes. There we go. We think maybe this is supposed to be the three quarters <laughs> of the trail mark. Because that, that's like where we're about there. But it kind of looks like a face to me now. We've hiked three quarters of the AT. Wow. Maybe. It's pretty cool. Maybe right now. Yeah, but either way, like today. This is Spruce Peak Shelter, it's really cool. It's enclosed, there's a sliding door that is fully open right now, but it can be closed. Hey! Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm using ramen as fire starter, but I just found out that only top ramen burns. And merchant doesn't really burn very well. Cool. It's raining, and this guy. Just started dunking his feet into water. Well, I'm doing this because my feet are so This bridge is an I-beam. Pretty cool. It's 
So Radio and I are gonna sleep. There's like a ski patrol cabin up here that's unlocked. Um, so Radio and I are gonna sleep up here for the night and it's heated, it has a dryer, it has a lot of space. Anyway, so it's just like really, really cool. So right there is the ski patrol cabin that we're staying in. And then there are the lifts. <laughs> Whoa! Is it your first day skiing? <laughs> well, I mean, ah! We gotta go. It's too cold up here. Yeah. What's going on, Coyote? Radio and I have block in the road. <laughs> We're like 100 feet down the trail. <laughs> and what it looks like. Now there's just soaking wet plants on either side. Yeah. Huh. Hey. Huh. Yeah. Love you. Love you too. There's a yeah. Yeah. So Radio and I have hiked probably like approaching six miles and like just the whole day has been the rain and the mud. Yeah, so our feet are cold and wet and soaked and I have no promise of my feet being dry until we're done hiking for the day. For probably ten more hours. Oh god, no. Yeah. That sounds horrible. <laughs> I know. All right, sorry, Coyote's legs are very, very <laughs> just dirty. But yeah, it's it's muddy today. Oh. Isn't it weird though that like you can tell that this is flooding, like the way that this looks? You yeah. can just tell it's flooding. Gosh, coyote. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> That's not ultra light. <laughs> Little rock pond. We literally just walked up to this lake and Radio just walked in with his full socks and shoes on and everything. And pack on. <laughs> That's so funny. We're just so soaked and walking through water all day that it doesn't matter if we're in the water or not. Suddenly the trail is not a waterfall. <laughs> Everything is moss. Down here there's a plane. Oh yeah. We're gonna see if we can watch it take off.
Whoa. It only used like so little of the landing. I mean, of the. Is that noise? Thing. That's the plane? I think so. We just got out into this like street and I think that we're getting our first view of Killington? I think that's Killington. Mountain. We have 500 miles left to Katahdin from here, wow. which is literally so crazy.